Hello boys and girls, welcome back to another YouTube tutorial video. Um, today we are going to be making a great food, famous food in the world, a sandwich. You guys all knew it was coming, uh, but first we're going to need some ingredients. Now, I have the ingredients on the right of me right over here. So first ingredient we're going to need, uh, we're going to need a ham, you know, you knew it was coming. Uh, some banana, get some nice nice protein. Some mayo, that's actually lotion. Um, some pickles, uh, it's a weird choice, but you know, trust me on this. P uh, peanut butter uh, crackers, those Ritz crackers, they're, they're pretty good, I, I like them. And, uh, ooh, and some milk. Yeah, 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 you, you think y'all know where that's coming from. Uh, that looks like a napkin, but it's actually a bib. Well, we're gonna do that for the eating, and, and step 10, um, well, you, you know what it is, we're gonna, we're gonna eat it. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's get, a uh, let's get started. Let's make, let's make, let's make this sandwich. First thing you wanna do to make your sandwich is to obviously open the sandwich, obviously, that's the most basic step. And now that we got that out of the way, let's uh let's get the first ingredient in. So we're gonna need to put the ham in first. That's that's our, our most that's like our key ingredient in there. Oh wait, I, I forgot one slice. Hold on. Oh there, there it is. All right, now now we're good. All right, let's get to the other ingredient. So our third ingredient, we're gonna get those Ritz crackers I was talking about. Those um these nice delicious. Uh, let me just get a let me just get all of them really quick. Okay. Um. So at, at this point of the of the process, you might get starting to get a little hungry. So you're just gonna you're just gonna eat them. Obviously, you're just gonna put them in your mouth. I know you you, you might have thought that we would have put them in the in the sandwich, but no. Like this, these are clearly for eating. Come on. Like, are you stupid? This is come on. So once you finish all your crackers, you're going to put your fourth ingredient in there, which is the bananas. The to get some of that vitamin B in your sandwich. B for banana, obviously. Uh, you might not be able to fit all of them in one uh, bread, but uh, as long as you get like 10 of them, you're, you're fine. So yeah, just, just keep on pressing. After that, you're gonna need to get your spoon, which hopefully you brought with you, and you're gonna get a big spoonful of mayonnaise like I have right here, and you're just gonna plop it in there, yeah. You're just gonna smear it all over the bananas to get that nice, creamy <laughs> creamy texture in your sandwich uh to really get that like get that texture in there uh yeah like put as, put as many as to, as much as you want uh you can even get more if you want for the yeah for the sixth step you're gonna need to get your the the pickles that you brought with you now i know they sound gross hear me, but hear me out um they actually give the sandwich a really good boost of flavor that you really need so you're gonna get your pickles you're gonna dunk them in the milk and you're just gonna smear it all over that and then you're gonna put it uh on the right side of your sandwich to give it uh some nuance some some real some real kick but enough about food get your glass of milk you, you deserve it come on uh you deserve a nice long break from all the work that you've been doing, you deserve it, you nice working boy. So get your glass of nice refreshing milk and pour it all over the, your sandwich. This is an important step because the milk gives the sandwich a really good juicy, squishy flavor that you're, that's really good. Now for the eighth and final step, or at least for the for the ingredients, you're gonna get your the your spoon again and get some peanut butter. And you're gonna get the peanut butter, put it in the sandwich, but not the way you think. You're gonna have to put it outside the sandwich because this, because of course, like you know, like if you put it inside the sandwich, then it's just gonna taste bad, obviously. So you gotta put it outside the sandwich to give it that like that new um like that interest to give it that like to make it look good, you know, to make it look really nice and like makes you really want to eat it. it. It's all part of the of the of the facade, the vision. So now you uh, and then now it's done. Um, I, I kind of destroyed the bib that I was gonna wear. It's all, it's all gross now. So I have to get a new one. I'll use the. Well, I don't know. I just, eh. yeah, I just get rid of that. I'll just get this one right here. All right, I'm gonna put this on, off camera, cause you, you can't really see me. Let's just. So now your sandwich is all done, and now the final step, to to eat it. So, let's get this. Big thing right here. Uh, let's take a bite out of it, at least one. So let's, no, 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 never mind. Okay, no, I'm not, are you, am I crazy? No, yeah, I am not gonna eat that thing. That's gross. Put that in the garbage. That is, ew, I'm, what the heck? No, like, no one's gonna eat that. Yeah, I kind of made a mess. Um, and that was a dis disgusting sandwich in my garbage can. Um. Yeah, uh, well, I guess that's it. So bye, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed this YouTube tutorial. 
Ah, oh, jeez. 